What it do, baby? You already know what it is. Boy Sam Easy back at it again from the new apartment. I am loving it so far. And today we're gonna be making it a little bit better. So as you know, I'm building a studio right here in the middle section. Right now, I kind of already have it in the layout that I want because I know I want my computer area to be right here. I'm thinking I'm gonna put like my printer one out here. I'm gonna raise these two boards here to make stands. I'm gonna put my studio monitors on those and then I'm also gonna be getting one more turntable whenever I can find one and put that right here so I can make a full turntable setup and then gaming chair is gonna be going right here and then I'm also gonna have the Alex drawers on both sides and then I'm gonna have a few legs in the center just for extra support just because I know how heavy everything is gonna be on these tables now this table right here that my computer is gonna be sitting on I believe this one's called like the lemon or the Lin lemon Something like that. This one over here was called like the lag captain something like that This one was about $48 and then the lemon was only like nine bucks without further ado I'm gonna go ahead and get started building it uh, I already know this is gonna be at least like a two or three part video just because of the fact that I left some essentials in Tallahassee that I definitely need to uh, Complete the full setup, but I still should be able to get most of it done today. So let's get started All right first things first. We're gonna go ahead and put together the Alex drawers. All right, so there we go just about two hours later got one drawer finished about to start the second one right now it shouldn't take as long just because i know what i'm doing now so hopefully i can get the next one done in about half the time so like an hour all right there we go that took way too long but now we have both alex drawers finished and we're gonna go ahead and attach the capital legs to the tops of these because i'm not gonna i'm not gonna attach the desk directly to the alex drawers i'm actually gonna raise them up about four inches with the capital legs so i'm gonna go ahead and do that now all right legs have been installed so i actually did screw them into the drawers it's Instead of screwing them into the tables because uh, if I want to move the table around I can do so without having to redraw holes I think it'll just work out a lot easier so yeah I did that so now it's time to put the legs on both of the desks and then I can go ahead and start finally putting everything together legs have been installed I decided to go two legs on each side instead of four because I think four is kind of overkill plus I already have the Alex drawers gonna be holding this up as well so I don't think I would have needed all four legs on each side so I think this should be good enough along with the Alex drawers all right finally looks like we're making some progress uh, got both of the Alex drawers and two tabletops also all the legs are connected everything sits pretty flush I had to adjust a couple of things so that there wasn't a height difference, but everything is looking good so far. I just have to put on my two monitor stands on each corner. I'm gonna also put on that long black shelf right here to create a computer monitor stand. Now I know what some people are wondering. They're wondering if the tabletops on the capital legs are uh, sturdy and the question is not really. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually get some 3M Velcro. Basically gonna attach the tabletop to the actual capital legs itself because the capital legs are already screwed into the Alex drawers. So I think if I do that, then everything should stick together. Now it's time to go ahead and attach this lac shelf, and I'm gonna rise this up with the capital legs as well, and then we're gonna turn this into a monitor stand right along here. So first set of the capital legs have been installed for the monitor stand. This should be just about a last step for the hardware process. Go ahead and install the other capital legs. These are like the original capital legs, like the slanted diagonal ones. I'm using these for the studio monitor speaker stands, and I'm gonna put these in each of the corners on this desk here. There we go, I have everything attached right now. All we have to do is start putting everything on here. I'm gonna put my turntables right here, booth monitors, and also studio monitor right here. But yeah, let's go ahead and get started doing that. And here we have, we finally have the full desk set up. Everything is finally put together. Please do not mind the cables. I have not done my cable management yet, but I'm gonna save that for a whole different video because uh, that's gonna <laughs> that's gonna take just as long as putting this whole desk together. But yes, this is how I'm gonna have everything set up. Like I said, I have my computer monitor right up here printer over here got my xbox some controllers got this little nice mouse bungee here for my wired gaming mouse also gaming keyboard as well i don't actually use my pc for gaming or anything but i mean i just like have the gaming keyboard because everything looks a little bit nice when it's all lit up and leds all over the place got my computer just sitting down here for right now i'm not gonna have this computer for too much longer um it's just like a old dell pc i bought like back in 2015 that 
Honestly, I, I just bothered just for, like, for schoolwork and whatnot. But it's definitely time to upgrade that as soon as possible, honestly. Uh, Alex drawers, not too much in these right now. Just, you know, a little storage, a little storage space. Got, like, my camera stuff down here. Same thing over here. It's going to be my DJ side. So I have, like, all my XLR cords, microphone stuff. Stuff to clean my records. And then also some more miscellaneous cables up here. And last but not least, I got my DJ side over here. I got my two monitor stands here. And then also I have my Pioneer DJM S7 here. And then also my Pioneer PLX 1000. Like I said, I just have one for right now. I am going to end up getting another one. I can shift everything over to the right just a little bit so I can have a full turntable setup. But yeah, let's go ahead and see what everything looks like at nighttime because I think that's where this shines the most. desk build all in all i think the total came out to just under 500 dollars i'll try to put like an itemized receipt or list somewhere on the screen like right now but yeah if you have any questions please do not hesitate comment below i'll do my best to answer them with the best of my abilities but yeah if you like the video then like the video also subscribe to the channel and i'll see you on the next one